Hi guys and welcome back to my channel, Sonic Love. In today's video, I'm really excited to show you a speaker that was sent to me by TomTop. As you know, that they've already sent me one product, which was absolutely fantastic. Really enjoyed it. As you know, of lately, I've been really testing out Android game performance, emulation, also cloud streaming services for Android, also for tablets, and also for various different phones which has been an absolute joy to have emulation running at full speed. I also reviewed the Kishi, Razer Kishi, which is absolutely fantastic. It actually took it to another level. And now I'm really, really enjoying uh, cloud gaming and also emulation on phones and tablets. So one thing that you can see in the background is my speakers. They are Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. So I have them hooked up when I'm stationary at my desk. But unfortunately, they're not very portable. So I asked uh, Tom Tom Top if they could send me a gaming speaker. So this is the Greva Star, which is pretty cool. It says crazy cool speaker with ultimate sound, Bluetooth 5.0, powerful sound, 30 hours of battery time, true wireless stereo. Now, as you can see by the box, it is premium. It's not cheap, guys. It comes in at around $299, which is pretty hefty. One of the most expensive speakers, uh, portable speakers that I've owned. But this is huge, guys. This is my hand. It is huge. And not only that, but it comes well packaged, well secure. I really, really love cyberpunk. I love anything to do with cyberpunk. Can't wait for the cyberpunk game to come out in November. Absolutely, truly excited. If you're excited for that game, let me know in the comments. But this took my eye straight away and it has got a bit of heft to it. It is very, very weighty. Now, it's a 20 watt speaker, so I'm expecting a little bit of punch from this as well. So, I'm using my tripod for the phone, sorry, um, because there's just no way that I could use the little tripod that I use to actually film this. So, that just gives you the grand scale of just how big this is. So, I just want to do a quick announcement. I have got a second channel, guys. Um, my other passion is art, as you well know. It's pretty much incorporated in with this channel. It's not a separate thing that I do. I do art and also emulation and anything related gaming wise really on this channel, which I absolutely love. It's my number one passion, drawing and gaming. But my other passion is swords, knives, tomahawks. Yeah, anything to do with cold sharp steel it is a passion of mine so i set up a second channel i will leave the link in the description below thank you to everybody who's subscribed already through the community post uh, thank you very much for the views on that i really need your help guys to make sure that the channel thrives um, i have 3000 nearly 3200 subscribers if i get 10 percent, 15 percent of you guys transferring over there to watch my other passion, I would absolutely love it. This was the first video that I did. This is such a cool blade. I absolutely love it. It's about £36, I think. You can get it cheaper if you look around, but it's so good. I absolutely love it. I love the form factor. I love how it feels. It's uh, titanium. It's really, really nice. It's got a lovely, like quick quick release handle on it which is really cool it's pretty nice it's pretty sharp it's ideal for fishing camping hunting even um, it's really nice if you want to see the video on it the unboxing and the video then please 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 check my second channel and i would love you forever so i'm going to use this particular knife that I demonstrated in my first video on my second channel to do the lovely seals.
very sharp one slice it was done jobs are good in so excited for this guys also arrived today which i'll do a video at some point and i will also test out with the speaker which will be absolutely fantastic and um, the 8-bit duo official xbox so i will do that with uh, some native android game and hopefully if it works on that side i'll test it with the galaxy s tab 7 so just to see what it's like it's got analog triggers really looking forward to it the clip is really good for the phones as well just to place in any direction which you feel comfortable or in the position that you are in, whether it be lying down, sitting up, and so forth. Really excited. Oh, I, I can't begin to tell you how exciting this is. I'm gonna lift the camera up, guys. Just to actually, yeah, the packaging is so well made. It would be for the price, but, so far I am very happy so straight away it's got a foam top cover it's got a nice little booklet obviously in all languages it just looks so futuristic so cyberpunk I absolutely love it One hand, not good. It does look absolutely incre incredible. It does have ambient light atmosphere for mood. It comes with a nice booklet. Like a styrofoam type lid, which is really nice. One hand, oh, there it is. Looks like something off Star Wars, man. It looks absolutely incredible. Right, so I'm gonna place the tripod down. And then. Lift it out the box. As I say, it is big guys, it's not small. Bit of weight to it as well, Jesus. Okay, let me get a closer. So let's do. Oh, it's really nice. It's metal. It's there's no plastic. It's all metal. The grey is plastic, actually. Tell a lie, with metal sheathing. But these white bits are solid metal. These are solid metal. So we've got the blowhole and we also have the speaker at this is really nice. Do you know what? Even before even the decals and the detail on it just look absolutely incredible. Let me get in for a little closer look for you guys. Absolutely amazing. I've already made my mind up that I'm actually going to buy one <laughs> uh, because they are interlinkable uh, up to a hundred. So if you you can get a hundred of these and they can all be all interlinked. I'm going to get another one. I've I'm I'm sold already. I haven't even tested tested it out yet, but just from the aesthetics and just how it looks. So obviously you can have it with its legs folded like what it is, but I do believe that you can shape them so 
so it then becomes at such a beefy bit of weight in this. But that just looks incredible. So obviously you may lower them down. So you've got a bit of tilt from the front and the back, or you can have it propped up higher. So there really is no end to the actual positioning of it, which is pretty nice. I kind of like the full extension of the legs, if I'm honest. I think it looks really nice. Yeah, first impressions, guys. I absolutely love it. I just think it's incredible. Right, what else do we get in the box? So it comes nice and secure. Let's move it. Yes, it's definitely got a bit of weight. Expensive paperweight. So it is Bluetooth. So we have a, we can hook it up to a tablet, a computer and so forth. That's nice. And hence the power cable. It is USB type C. It doesn't seem to be a plug, but that's here nor there. As I say, it does come with ambient light. It does have a 20 watt speaker, which is not too bad, really. One thing that I do miss about cloud gaming is having a vivid speaker to actually listen to the music and the ambient effects. And I think that a good 70% of games, the music it makes it immersive. So to actually have a port a really powerful portable speaker to travel downstairs or upstairs or it's just really good because these speakers are fantastic. The Y6s when I'm stationary here at the desk. But as I say, when I go downstairs I haven't got that luxury. So the cable's got a good bit of length, which is nice. Careful ladies, which I like. It is pretty standard, but much welcome. So what I'm gonna do guys, power of YouTube and all that, I'm gonna set it up a little bit. We'll do some testing with a bit of music. I don't know what I'm gonna use, but something that hopefully won't get a copyright strike. But my first impressions guys, this thing, even just for looks alone, uh, it's just fantastic. If I had two of these, I could easily take these downstairs and quite happily have these set up here either side of my tablets and i would be more than happy in fact i might even do that i'm definitely going to order myself one they do come in three different colors gold trim a black version and also the black and white version yeah, absolutely fantastic wonder if this is touchscreen because it says max at the top a minimum at the bottom, so maybe that is touch for volume. We'll see, we'll have to test it out. But yeah, I, I'd i love to know what you think of it, guys. I just think it's absolutely amazing. I will see you in a tick. Hi guys, and I'm back. So I put it on charge for a little while. I didn't know if it had any battery in it. I just thought I'll give it a charge for an hour and then hopefully it will work. So you will see like three dashes. This is control for the ambient light. This is the power on button. That one is the stop. This one is the Bluetooth pairing. It gives you a volume level indicator of where it's at here. And it does some pretty cool things, especially sound wise. So when you turn it on, I did have a look to see if there was like some type of remote, but I don't seem to find one. Um, I did have a good look inside the box, but it would have been nice to have like a little remote or something to go with it, but it doesn't seem to be the case. But with it being a portable speaker, I don't think you will be bothered with not having one. I'm certainly not bothered. But when you turn it on, it makes a cool little robot sound and it pumps out a, the a little bit of bass to go with it, it's really nice. Bluetooth connected. 
and it tells you that it's connected to Bluetooth. It also gives you a little disconnect sound when you disconnect. Bluetooth disconnected. Bluetooth connected. So now it's paired. When you turn it off, it comes with a similar sound. Chucks a bit of bass at you. So as you can see, the, the ambient light is on all three legs. It's on the side. I don't know if you can see that. It also has the treble speaker also lights up inside, which is absolutely fantastic. So this is your treble and your high range. It probably might just be treble actually, I'm not too sure, I'm just guessing. But then at the back, this is your bass. So this is the subwoofer. I thought it was the speaker, but it's actually the subwoofer. So it's up to you in which direction that you would want this facing. Personally, I think this is the best way. I think this is the way that it was supposed to be intended to be. It just looks absolutely fantastic. It sounds absolutely gorgeous. I'm absolutely in love with it. Yeah, is it worth the price? Let's test some music and find out. I'd say we're so far, we're at halfway value. 299, I say we're at 150 just through aesthetics, what it looks like. Just really, just really pleasing to the eye. I don't think, I've, I've not seen anything look quite like this. It's really beautiful. Absolutely, I can't wait to see it in the evening as well. Look really nice. So I'm going to try and do some music that is not copyright. So let me find some for starters. It is a touch sensitive on the top for volume. Which is just incredible. I absolutely love it. Yeah, I am absolutely in love with this. It is absolutely incredible. The bass is nice. The sound is crisp and sharp. Oh, 
I'm a happy man. I'm a very, very, very happy man. I love my speakers and this is something so unique. I don't think there's anything else quite like it out there. I love all the features. I just think it's absolutely great. You can turn off the lights if you want to. I can't seem to find if you can change the color. I think it is just one color. So it hasn't got an RGB range. But, oh, the Gravastar is absolutely fantastic. It is so cyberpunk. It is really incredibly well made. The sound is beautiful. And I am about to go to Tom Top and order myself another one. And so I have them both paired. And you will see them either side in future videos because I just think it's absolutely incredible. So what I'll do guys, in the next video I will be reviewing and uh, unboxing the 8-bit duo, the official Xbox controller for gaming. I will obviously pair that up with this while we're doing the gaming so you can get to see what the sound is like with emulation and also cloud gaming. But guys, uh, if you like your speakers and you're looking for a portable speaker, I don't think there's anything better than this at the moment for aesthetics, looks, style. It's, yeah, sound. It's absolutely beautiful. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope that you've enjoyed it. I will leave a link in the description if you want to order one for yourself. They're non-affiliate. I don't get any money for any of these links that I put on my channel. Nine times out of 10, I buy the products myself. This time, uh, I've only had like three products sent to me. This was the third one. And I'm so glad that Tom Top did because it'd probably be something that I wouldn't buy. But now I actually have it here. Uh, I just think it's absolutely incredible. And the base out of this thing is bloody lovely. Yeah, I just think it's very well made. It's a solid device. It looks good, it sounds good. And I think it will be an eye catcher for anyone coming into your home. They'll just be like, what the beep is that? And you just go, oh yeah, wait till you hear it. I, th I love the gimmicks. The the touch screen on the top as well, touch sensitive for the volume, just little things like that, just, yeah, I am very happy. Give it a like, please subscribe for more crazy tech and also gaming and drawing related videos. Please check out guys, my second channel, if you love swords, if you like knives, if you like tomahawks, if you like hatchets. I've actually got a bullhead butcher's blade a 14 inch, like this blade will cut through bone like a knife through butter. That will be the next one that I will be unboxing and showcasing in my second channel. But as always guys, take care.